Good morning. Happy Bank Holiday Monday. The sun is shining, it's bright, it's lovely. Um, and we've come for a day out to Port Lim Zoo. So I haven't been here for a while. I've been here, uh, I can't remember the last time I came here. I think when Ashley was younger. But we're looking forward to a good day, aren't we, Chloe? Uh -huh. Oh, Chloe's got hiccups. Mm -hmm. Hiccup. <laughs> So what are you looking forward to seeing the most? Do you know what's here? You've been here uh, um, more, more recently than me. No, I've been here. I don't That's think I've been here with you. I think I've been here. Last time I came here was with Ashley. Oh, the hyenas love me. They probably about me. ten years ago. <laughs> they have dinosaurs now. Dinosaurs, the real been, ones. We no, we haven't been here with the dinosaurs yet. Oh, well, hopefully, <laughs> it's lovely, isn't it? Huh? In the entrance we're on our way to the start of all the main park um, I think from what I remember Portland's quite spread over a large area uh, but I don't remember any of this bit so this must be all different from when I came before but um, yeah it's this lovely setting right in the middle of the Kent countryside so there's lots of trees and fields it's lovely So we're on the safari, ready to go. And we're off. It's going to be a bit bumpy. Bumpy, no, no. <laughs> We've been on our safari, we got off down at the bottom bit, so we're just having a little walk to see some animals now, but we saw, as you see, we saw giraffes, and then they also had the giraffe lodges, which just overlook all the, I think it's the South Downs, just amazing, even if you never see any animals, just that view would be fantastic, but it's like £180 per person from that much. So we've all got ice cream, but they'd run out of fruit ones and only had ones with milk in, so Chloe couldn't have it, so she just queued up all the way for a Calippo ice lolly. Yay! At last! Last one! <gasps> that was lucky then, wasn't it? Into the dinosaur forest. Ah, dinosaur Chloe! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Fish out of water. <laughs> so this dinosaur bit is really, really good, especially if you if you like dinosaurs as well, obviously. But it's all in the woods and there's like all these dinosaurs and then all the information about each dinosaur. Yeah, it's really good. There's loads of them. And they look really good because they're in the woods as well. And I'm not really sure how many times I just said really good, but too many, I think. <laughs> as fast as, why don't you crawl? <laughs> Go, 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 Chloe. Hi. All the smooth things. Found a little albino wallaby. Can I see him back there? It's a red one. A red one? Oh, no. oh. <laughs> the enclosures here are really big. This is like a monkey enclosure. <laughs> and they're sitting up in that tree over there. And then we were like, come on. And then we got these ones. Huge. They don't have as many trees in this one, though. No, <laughs> Mm. Wallaby walk through. Oh, there's one over there. Just down the path. So these are little pine wood if you're staying in these. And then you get that there's a little fire pit. They're so cute. Look at that amazing view. This is our new house. <laughs> yeah, we wish, eh? <laughs> We're going on a tiger hunt. Hoping we can find it. Oh, I can see it. Most of the animals, I think it's just, it's just too hot for them. A lot of them have just either been hiding or sleeping. So we haven't seen that many animals, to be honest. But Chloe wanted to see the tigers. This is the main reason we come. <laughs> and she's found it. Oh, he has a lot, a lot of water in there. <laughs> there he is. Sleeping. It's got to be more than one though, surely. <laughs> We've had a lovely day at um, Port Lim. We're on our just to walk into the car now. What was your favourite animal, Lulu? Gorilla. The what? Gorilla. The gorillas. And the other monkeys that you didn't see. Oh, I didn't see them. We've now been looking to see about staying there because from what we can see, I mean, it's quite expensive. Yeah. Oh. But <gasps> what? The bird, I saw the shadow comes. Oh, ah. I thought it was attacking you. But you can walk around after the yeah. once it's shut and stuff. So. It do, they do they do look really nice and the view is absolutely stunning um so we're gonna have a little look add that to our list of things that we want to do uh it's getting quite long this list now <laughs> um well yeah we do have money but it, it costs a lot of money you know if you're paying 800 pound for one night in a thing that's quite a lot of money <laughs> uh, but overall we really enjoyed Port Lim. It's the setting is amazing. The enclosures are fantastic for the animals. They have so much space and they do have the privacy, which is great for the animals. 
unfortunately not so great for us when you want to see them but that's just the luck of it really sometimes you walk if you walk past and the animals are out then you get to see them other times you don't it's the way it is but um yeah really really impressed and also we managed to get a voucher for the girls if you book it in advance like the night before you get it a bit cheaper and also Craig got a, a voucher I think it must have been on their website that if you just sign up to it the kids go for a pound so I think it was 22 pound for adults was it 22 pound I think it was 22 pound for adults and the girls went for a pound so I think that's quite reasonable um, for because I think they should have been like 19 pounds each. So that's a big um, saving. So yeah, if you're gonna go, try and see if you can get a, a deal somewhere. But we would highly recommend it. It's quite hilly, so, but you can just go round on the little bus train thing. Don't really know what it is. Um, but yeah, it's quite hilly, but it is lovely. Uh, toilets regularly, all the way round. Uh, little cafe things only thing I'd say if you're vegan not so good really struggled to find Chloe something to eat so she ended up with just chips but otherwise yeah thumbs up mm -hmm.